Hi, my name is Kieran Bernard and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Intersol Corporation. With each generation of satellites that come out, the number of data and sensors that need to be processed increases. With the limited number of IOs available on microprocessors, we employ the use of analog multiplexers to access the plethora of sensors out there with just a single I.O. pin. With Intersol's next generation of analog MUXs, we will offer two different flavors on our new P6 SOI process, a 16-channel MUX as well as a 32-channel MUX. The 16-channel ISL71840 is meant to be a form, fit, and function replacement for our legacy HS1840, which has over 30 years of flight experience already. So customers can take the new ISL71840 and drop it into their current designs and expect better performance. For customers considering new designs, we're also going to offer the 32-channel ISL71841. It offers a 41% space savings over using two ISL71840s, or in the case of old designs, the HS1840. The ISL71840 and 41 still maintains the cold sparing capabilities of its predecessor for redundant applications. For the ISL71840, it still has the same bond pad locations as the HS1840, so even the die is a drop-in replacement. Now, some key improvements that we've made on these parts compared to the HS1840 is that we now offer rail-to-rail -rail operation. The ISL71840 also has lower R on without sacrificing leakage currents. It achieves the same leakage current specs as the HS1840 and in some cases is lower. It also has redundant decoders that vastly improve its SET performance and shorter prop delays. It also features an automatic input over voltage shutoff which disables that specific channel in the case of an over voltage event. It also offers 100 dB of off isolation and crosstalk rejection which is much better than the 45 dB of the HS1840. We've also got 8 kV of human body model ESD protection compared to the 250 of the HS. Also, the AVMAX supply voltage has been bumped up to plus or minus 20 volts with a max recommended operating at plus or minus 16 and a half volts. Customer feedback is very important at Intersil and a lot of it was taken into consideration during the design phase of the next generation MUXs. With the lower R on, improved leakage, vastly improved SET performance and 8 kV human body model ESD protection, the ISL71840 will upgrade your current designs for better performance. And if you need to sense more than 16 channels at once, we've got the 32 channel ISL71841. These two new additions represent the next generation of Intersil's rad hard analog multiplexers. For more information or to order these eval boards, please visit intersil.com. Thank you.